I when I first played Mario RPG, I was yeah, Kyle and Jessica bickering will be really fun. And I was like, Kyle, you're talking. Kyle, she clearly likes you. You need to be careful about this kind of stuff. There's a reason why your relationship did isn't quite working out. Anyway, um, I was going to make. Here I would make that comment. Ah, oh, men. But that is kind of weird coming from me. Anyway, um, let's see. I don't think there's any. There's no weapon shop here, so let's just go. Let's go down the the hatch. What do you have to say, sir? Dude, my boss is hanging with you. Excellent. You should stop by Reza and check out the yearly harvest. Okay, so we're going to go to south. I think we're gonna see how far we can get in the dungeon. Ooh, dungeon music. Well, this is going to be a little bit less exciting to talk about. Marius Zone. What do you have to say, sir? I've heard of a man in the Marius Zone who is supposed to be one of the wisest men in the world. Perhaps this daemon could determine the weak point of the Magic Emperor and tell us how to bump him off. Oh, we're just gonna fight flies. Well, I suppose this is the best time to talk about off-topic stuff because, frankly, these gigawatts aren't really going to kill us anytime soon. And unfortunately, we have Jessica to heal us, so... I'm pretty sure Nash... What? Come on, Alex. You should be able to kill them in one shot. Uh... Oh, yeah, at least he can move twice. Uh, free XP and free money. I think this game is very, very stingy about money, so it is probably a good thing to get some EXP and and um, money. In Mario RPG, I was stupid and didn't realize that I didn't know how levels worked. I didn't know there was a level. I actually treated Mario RPG like a regular Mario game where I avoided all the enemies because I thought, oh, you're supposed to avoid the enemies. Why you don't have to fight every single one of them? And then I found out, oh, Geno is three levels above me when I got him. So when that happened, oh, hold on, let me read this guy first. Hey, boss. Hey, Jessica. I haven't seen you around here in a while. You two are getting along, aren't you? My ears were ringing for a week the last time you two got into a fight. I figured that would be the case, wouldn't it? Don't worry. Kyle knows better than to argue with me again. Huh. And so I got Jen. I was like, oh, shoot. You're actually supposed to fight things. That's why I was having so much trouble. So, like, Mac the Knife actually just kicked my butt the first time when I fought him. And he's, like, one of the first um, of Smitty, the Smitty minions you fight. And he was just kicking my butt. He kicked my butt really early. And I was like, why am I having so much trouble? And I struggled to beat him with items. Because I didn't realize that you were supposed to level. So it's really interesting, so I didn't know what an RPG was until I played Mario RPG. So that's actually the first one I've played. So I, it has a lot of nostalgia value for me personally. And it's like a lot of people I know also started that way too. Hello children, I've heard <laughs> I've heard that there is a huge volcano on the west side of the Marius zone. And where there are volcanoes, there are usually hot springs. I'd love to have just one soak in that wonderful water. It might even cure my arthritis. Well, I guess I can carry over there, old man. But I don't know. It's not that safe here. So where does this go? South. Marius zone. East. Nanza barrier. Hmm. Oh, Kyle. How are you? Thank you so much for having your men escort us through the barrier. I've never felt so safe. <laughs> oh, yes, Kyle. You're a great man indeed. Watching you. Charm women and rip off men have never made me feel so sick. What did you say, Nash? Why don't you speak above? <coughs> Why don't you speak above a whisper and share that with the rest of us? My Kyle, aren't we defenses? I was just clearing my throat. If you want to beat someone up, how about the Magic Emperor? Oh, you Nash, trying to storm pot shots. Mom, look, it's Kyle. 
When I grow up, I'm going to steal money and be really rich like him. Oh boy. You're wise beyond, beyond your years, kid. You have a great future ahead of you. Uh, perhaps you should suggest this young boy pursue a career outside of crime? What do you have to say, sir? Uh... Hail, Kyle! Just as you ordered, we've been protecting all the women and children free of charge. Good, good. <laughs> oh my gosh. And you've rem <clears throat> and you've remembered to charge men double the normal fee, haven't you? Hehe. <laughs> Once a bandit, always a bandit. I'm not even sure how you fell in love with him, uh, Jessica. We haven't taken any payment from women or children crossing the barrier, even when it was offered. Well, that's good. So if we go east, I'll go back to the Nanza barrier. I'm curious about this. I'll just go east for fun. And not like the enemies here are really tough, so I don't care. But yeah, so... I don't even know which. I played a lot of RPGs since Mario RPG, that's for sure. I think the next one I played would be. Was it FF7? I think FF7 was the next. FF7 and 6, are roughly around the same time. Alright, Alex is uh, ki kicking the butt. That's pretty funny. He walked up to her and didn't reach her, and then she smacked him. But yeah, the... Um, ooh, here's a chest. I'm gonna save. No, that took a, took a while. I'm gonna leave that save in Nanza first. I'm gonna save in three. Okay. Let's see what's here. Angel's Tear. That could be very helpful. Unfortunately, I still can't open locked chests. So that's not really gonna help us. Oh, wait, that's not. This is such jazzy music for dungeons. It's actually really. I love the, the soundtrack of this game is really good. Like, really, like. No wonder, like, in. We. In a Japan Expo. Ooh, new world map. Something's up ahead. The music has changed too. I don't know why the music is so soft compared to the sound effects. It is kind of weird. I can't change that either. There's no way to change the volume here, so... Oh well, whatever. Let's see over here. Huh. Yeah, I like how they put a bot a beer bottle here just to for extra effect. So I don't know where this place is. But we might as well stay here. This is Re This is Reza, a re refuge for those too guilty to face the law abiding world. Huh. This is the den of thieves, I guess. All these people call Reza the town of thieves, but we don't just steal from anyone, you know. We only go after the rich folks who can afford it. You know, people like Master Mel. What? If I ever caught you break into my house, I'd crack your kneecaps. Be careful who you talk to. Uh... Yes, I believe what he's worked on. I think he's working on some... Most of his stuff is now mostly on mobile from what I remember. But I not, I'm not entirely sure on that one. Oh, oops. Um, he actually did a concert la in last year's Japan Expo here in the in the Bay Area. It's the United States one, not the French one. And so I was I kind of missed out on that. It was actually right before Masquerade, so I heard a little of it. But at the time, I hadn't played Lunar, so I didn't know any of the songs he played. So which is too bad. I probably if I had played that game last year, then I would have been known it. Oh well, I kind of. 
I think last year was the was the year I didn't beat a single RPG. So it was pretty dismal for RPGs. <laughs> for myself for R the RPG day for RPG year. I actually had beaten more action games that year. So this is the year I've actually I think this is the most RPGs I've ever beaten in my life in not my life. No, it might be my life, huh? No, not quite. But it is the most I've had beaten in any recent time. So that would make because it would be Pop for Mail, Soul Blazer, Shinjin One, and now I'm worth playing this one. So I'm at, it's pretty pretty good. I've had played quite a few games now that I have forced myself to play regularly thanks to this stream. Uh, I guess we don't have a key. I guess I can talk to the NPCs. They, not much. They'll have any much interesting things to say. But you know, it's good to get a feel for this place. You know, uh, there's nothing I can do here. So. What do you have to say, little one? Or a uh, woman? Hello children, are you lost? It wouldn't surprise me. Reza was intentionally built with a confusing design to make it easier for thieves to hide and to run away. My husband is a member of the guild and he still gets out lost for hours at a time. Huh. Oh, what's in here? Whoa. Whoa, that's a lot of corridors. Let me come back out first. This is weird. Let's see what you have to... The Big Book of Suckers. Avoiding arrest. The easy way. These sure are some amazing books, Alex. I steal, therefore I am. The Big Book of Su Oh, wait, I just read that. What do you have to say, sir? I was headed for the Thief's Bazaar, but I stumbled into the Guild Hut headquarters instead. I hate it in there. All they do is talk about which thieves make the most money. Just because I'm not pulling in the big bucks doesn't mean I'm not I'm not a good thief. Them's the breaks, man. Them's the breaks. Uh, I guess I can go down here and see where this takes me. I don't think... One thing I know about this game is that there's no really no secret items. Most of everything is just cosmetic for fun. I don't think I've seen a side quest in this game too. Oh well. It looks like I'm in someone else's house. I don't know where this is. Very confusing place. As they describe, aptly described. Yeah, I'm back. Oh, so that's the that was the way out. That's cool. So this is a. Uh, I get this. I guess this is the item shop. Stroll directly south from here, and you will find the town of Ilok. It is a, always a gamble to travel there for the purpose of purposes of thievery. The inventions to be found are either quite valuable or quite worthless. Huh? So that's where the geniuses were. Huh? The thief town is right next to the the genius, the scientific town. That's an interesting setup. Well, of course my store is small. Low overhead me equals high profits. Now come on, buy something. So what do you what do you have to sell, sir? Uh, not a whole lot that I, I'm interested in. I'll I'll get back to you on that one. So you're leaving already? Fine. Maybe you'll spend a little more the next time you're in here. Uh, let's see. Welcome to Reza. Not exact, <laughs> not exactly the wealthiest town in the Marius Zone, but a great place to learn the latest news and gossip. <laughs> and the beer is lovely. Whoa! Hey! Excuse me. Uh oh. No, are you all right? Hmm. Well, the inhabitants of Reza certainly are rude. I think we've just been stolen. Oh, Lunar. Yes. Uh, hello, Running Wild Vidya. Welcome. Um, so, sadly, you might be catching me near the uh, with only a f about 10 or 15 more minutes, but that's okay. I'm playing Lunar. And yeah, this is the project game I'm working on right now. I can see why Kyle fits in so nicely here. <laughs> She's just going to take pot shots. Hey, no, did that guy bump into you? 
Yes? Uh-oh. Wait! The white dragon wings! They're gone!